Hello, my name is Brett Lone and I'm a professional artist based in Epsom Downs. Uh, you may have seen my work uh, in the Queen Stand at the race course. I exhibit during racing and I work very closely with the Jockey Club. And so we um, were talking about the Platinum Jubilee and the Derby Festival and thought it would be a great idea to produce a painting to commemorate um, this special occasion. And so uh, about six months or so ago we got together and, and talked about various things and came up with this idea of producing an oil painting of the Prince's Stand um, during racing. Uh, and so here it is, uh, the Prince's Stand during the Coronation Cup. Um, and I, uh, I was actually, I've many times have attended racing, stood at this vantage point because it's such an iconic building. It means so much to Epsom, has such great history, and of course is a listed building. Um, and in this painting, it represents the monarchy because it's the Prince's Stand, we have the Coronation Cup, uh, and the horse here that we see in the foreground is Yates, uh, who won the Coronation Cup and is named after the artist J.B. Yates. And so I thought it would be a great idea to show how the arts have often been showcased by the royal family with the monarchy as the backdrop. And that's very much the case with my own career. Uh, when I first started, I was helped by the Prince's Trust uh, and given mentorship and um, financial aid by the Prince's Trust. And, and through the course of that, the Prince of Wales wrote to me a few times and I painted one of his horses. Uh, and that for me, obviously, as a, as a starting artist, that really was very encouraging and gave me great confidence. So it was a great boost for me. And I wanted really to, to put that forward, to show that uh, through a painting and how, how the, the royal family have um, helped the arts so much. So um, this is a mind-bogglingly complicated oil painting. Uh, every blade of grass is sort of seven or eight brush strokes, but I paint very much what the eye sees, so I'm, I'm very much hoping for an open window. Uh, and you can get the atmosphere of Epsom. We have um, the Prince's Stand representing the royal family, the monarchy. It's constant there. Things around are changing. You've got the marquees and the people moving around, but there's one constant that's always there. Uh, and it's the same with the Union flag at the top there. Although the clouds are moving around and changing, the flag is constant. Um, representing the nation. So we have uh, the, the other horse there was the horse that came second uh, in the same race, Alcar said. So there's continuity there and really the idea, so I start, uh, having been there many times during racing, uh, I start with a sketch like the one you see behind me, which I mean I call it a sketch, that was a drawing that um, took weeks to produce, uh, but obviously uh, living very locally, being my studio being based very locally, I'm able just to turn up with my easel and, and get everything right. So that's a, a great advantage. So um, the painting has taken about six months in total, a, a lot of late nights, um, but we're very pleased with the result. I thought it would be a great idea to then combine uh, this painting with helping a racing charity, Racing Welfare, who's a fabulous charity for racing and the racing community. Um, so it's being published as a limited edition print, um, and then we're going to, from each print, we're going to give money to the to Racing Welfare to help them. Uh, so it's a great way of supporting them and very unique to Epsom uh, and the unique atmosphere of this uh, fantastic race course and fantastic race meeting.